Austin Butler is thinking back to the terror he had while he was playing the legendary Elvis Presley in Baz Luhrmann's Elvis. He was on Jimmy Kimmel Live. The 31-year-old actor discussed the intimidating procedure on Monday. It was simply a particularly overwhelming thing, and in reality, my only guide was my fear, he said. The biopic is presently named for three brilliant Globe grants, including Best Picture Show, Best Chief and Best Entertainer Dramatization for Austin Butler, who said he had assemblages of Presley's voice that he would listen to each day his snicker, different songs for hours. The actor said, and then once I was allowed to leave the apartment, I would usually wake up every day around 3 or 4 in the morning with this terror. The actor worked intensely with voice, movement, and singing coaches to help him transform. Austin Butler made his admission to Jimmy Kimmel. The Presley family has approved of Austin Butler's impersonation. After receiving a private screening in April, Priscilla Presley, the late king of rock and roll, gushed about Lerman's vision and Austin Butler's performance. For those curious about the new film Elvis, Baz Luhrmann, the director, provided a private screening for me and Jerry Schilling at Warner Studios recently, she said. This story is about Elvis and Colonel Parker's relationship, she wrote at the time on Facebook. She continued, it is a true story told brilliantly and creatively that only Baz could have delivered in his unique artistic way. Austin Butler, who played Elvis, is outstanding. Tom Hanks plays Colonel Tom Parker, Presley's manager. Hanks narrated the trailer when it first came out, saying, there are some who make me out to be the villain of this year's story. Butler's Elvis arrives on the scene and gives a rousing performance, which draws Parker's attention to the young singer's talent. Or on the other hand, does it recently come thumping at your door? Parker states, I watched that skinny boy transform into a superhero at that very moment. Parker tells a young Presley, I wish to promote you, Mr. Presley, as he talks to him. He was my destiny. Are you prepared to take off? Presley says, I'm ready, grinning. Ready to fly. Butler explained why he wanted to play Presley at a February press event, saying that fundamentally getting to explore the humanity of somebody who has become the wallpaper of society in a way was the main reason. He's such an icon and held to superhuman status was what drew him in, said Butler, who won the role over Harry Styles and Miles Teller. To get to investigate that for quite a long time and realize the reason why he was how he was, it was such a delight that I could do that until the end of my life most likely.